Look at the size of these yellow mouse. They're, they're back. <laughs>
new 43 inch release pole. It's just like a boater grip. Here's a 60 pound boater grip. And picking out of holding the fish with this, I always have to lean over the side of the boat. And that gets real old. So I picked this up on Amazon just for that purpose to hold bull redfish or any other big fish over the side of the boat. Got this on my Tools of the Trade uh, Amazon page where you can find this thing. It was a little expensive. Uh, upwards of 40 bucks, 50 bucks. But it's got a release just like a boger grip and it's got the jaws. And boy, did that, that works out. Releasing a bull redfish with this. If the sides of your boat are kind of high, this is another recommended tools of the trade. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. It worked out perfectly. Sheep's head in the box. <laughs> yeah. our, our lady angler snags number two. This is number two on this spot and it's blowing like holy hell and the tides are screwed up <laughs> and we're catching them on shrimp. Catching them on shrimp. Yes sir. Catching them on the shrimp. In the box with you buddy. Number three. Dave finally got one. I got bit. I got bit and I missed the first one but I got him on the second go round. Of course he's not big. <laughs> he has to be the smallest one, of course. Hey, I'm glad to get a bite. Number four. And I got him right where Joe was fishing, and then he moved, and I stepped over there, dropped down, and he, the sinker hit the bottom, and that, this son of a gun jumped right on it. So That's his story, and he's sticking to it. And the old, the old saying is, is move your meat, lose your seat. Oh, oh, you're, yeah. oh, you're supposed to be sick today? Yeah. <laughs> hey, you can go. There's not a chance in hell my boss is watching. No.